In this tutorial, I want to show you a power user shortcut with text comparison. And to set this up, I want you to type ESV in the command box. ESV in the command box, press the enter key to open the English Standard Version of the Bible. When the Bible opens, I want you to take it to Galatians 2.16. So click in the reference box, type your abbreviation, Galatians 2.16, and press the enter key. Okay, so here we are in Galatians 2, 16. And what I'm about to show you, you can do with any Bible. Actually, you can also do it with any commentary, any versified resource. So we're in Galatians 2, 16, and we want to preview text comparison for this passage. On your keyboard, press the F7 key, F7. If you're using a Mac, you may also need to hold down the function key, the F in key and then press F7. So F7 and watch what happens on the screen. You're seeing across the screen a preview of text comparison and Lagos is using the Bibles that you have prioritized in your library and it will display as many Bibles as you have room for on the screen. If you will click outside of that pop-up preview, that pop-up closes. So let's do that again. Click inside the Bible's tile. You're studying in a passage. You want to quickly preview text comparison. Press F7. Again, on the Mac, you may need to hold down the function key. F7, and you get a pop-up preview. Let's say now we want to jump to the actual text comparison report. All you have to do is click inside the verse, perhaps click one of the differences. So I'll come down here in the New Revised Standard and I'll click the word justified. When I click the word, notice the text comparison panel actually opens. So go ahead and close text comparison and let's return to the Bible. Let's say we don't want to just preview a single verse, Galatians 2, 16, but we want to preview a range of verses, 16 through 18. All you need to do is type that in the Bible's reference box. So click inside the reference box, Galatians 2, 16, then put a hyphen, and then 18. Press the enter key. You'll notice that range is now in the reference box. This time, press F7, again on the Mac, function F7, and look carefully at your preview. You're not just getting verse 16. You're getting verse 16, verse 17, and you may have to scroll, you'll get verse 18. You will preview whatever is in the Bible's or the commentary's reference box.